I wasn't born there, but I spent most of my life in Mumbai. It was challenging, a whole bunch of innovation happening. The internet suddenly changed everything. I'm a constant fan of learning. I think that's kind of the number one thing that keeps me going. I can't be static. I just have to constantly either tinker on something, learn something new. I've traveled to more than 700 plus cities in my lifetime. I can speak eight languages fluently. I'm learning French and Spanish right now. Anything new, I like to learn. I track and measure everything. Not because I'm just doing it because of the sake of doing it. I like to improve myself constantly. I've actually spent my entire life trying to work on IT and IT-based technologies. Now, IT-based technologies is, can be really boring, can be really complex, can have a lot of data to go through, and usually to get results out of it, it's extremely difficult. We started applying AI technology on top of data that basically comes from all these IT systems. My team is responsible for this thing called AI ops in the autonomous database. You want people to be able to manage extremely large cloud environments without actually having to know about it. So the ops person just has to go, press an easy button, and something fixes itself. My team builds that stack. So we deal with some extremely complex problems where we can predict machine failures. We can predict when a customer should be allocating more resources to their job so they can finish faster and makes them more productive. All this stuff gives an immense amount of availability, reliability, and takes out complexity from IT infrastructure and lets the developers focus on one thing, build stuff. That's what the autonomous database is all about. It enables businesses to discover the true value of their data. Solving these use cases are very important to customers because otherwise customers need to solve them. And every customer will develop their own method of trying to solve these things. They're not exactly efficient. The two things in any AI problem, access to humongous amounts of training data, and second is applying the right algorithms to it to get the results. We have the data, we have the resources to apply these algorithms, and once we apply them, whatever results that come out of it, we can apply them to a whole bunch of customers. And everybody benefits without each of every one of them having to reinvent the wheel on this one. That's why it's very important to take the collective intelligence of what we develop in the cloud and apply this to all customers so everybody benefits. If I ask you to keep your phone running, that's extra work for you. That's not what you bought the phone for. You want the phone to just run, and you want to work on the application that's on the phone. And that's what AI Ops does for you. It takes away all this complexity so that we apply collective intelligence, data, and algorithms that we have applied across a whole bunch of customer scenarios, and everybody benefits. As a vision, basically all data as a data platform will be manageable under autonomous. No matter what kind of data you have, no matter what kind of format it comes from, we will know what kind of data it is and we'll be able to apply the right algorithms to it. So we're a data management company and we'll continue to get better and better at data management to be able to unlock all these innovations for customers.